happens? I do, I want to know, I want to know. Right. Just you want me to just tell you? Sorry, tell me what happens, yeah, go on. Okay. So once I have them tying up, and once I can touch them everywhere, like this, and let's just suppose she's tied up. I'll start off here on her terms. And if she lifts me, I just have my hand going here. And when she's okay with that, then I get my waist. Could you actually just hold it in the Yeah, room? sure. Oh, and I hope that she won't move. I don't want to tire because I used to have a tire in a few weeks now. Yeah, whoa. Oh. So once I get my weight on her, I'm doing this. And my hand is always going here where my leg will be, you see. Yeah, yeah. And we, this, this will be a day by day, this will be day seven or whatever. And then I will put my knee over. Whoa! Oh, steady, steady. <laughs> I'll put my knee over, but I won't put my leg over. Because I'm always ready to get off, you see. Gotcha. So my knee is over and I'm kind of getting used to touching all the places that my leg will be touching. And eventually when she's comfortable I will ch I'll chance putting my leg over. You know, like that. And, and uh, always ready to get off for a few days. Then there will come a time when I'll have to commit. But she'll be well, I'll be f we'll, we'll trust each other by then, you know. And, I've, I've actually, sure, I've been doing that now for 20 years. And so far, I've never had to get off. My mom is ready to get off, but I've never had to get off in a scurry. But I'm not counting my chickens. <laughs>